Hey guys, so we've just been rooting around in Thomas Waite's safe, um, just coming from his house where his daughter had been horribly mauled by her mother, which was... I mean, it was kind of our it fault. Won't budge. I think I think we can take that. Um, and we've just found the Book of Dagon, which talks about Dagon, his consort Hydra, and mentions our boy Cthulhu. Um, so this is definitely getting a little bit spicy. It's getting late. Better, better start, start making, making tracks. tracks. I don't much fancy spending the night in this hole. Well, how often does the bus come by? I guess we'll uh, find out. I think one of the things I do like about um, the naming conventions of H.P. Lovecraft is he kind of he juxtaposes consonants. Like, so Cthulhu sleeping in Relia, right? Having the R and the L next to it means that you have to say it in a very awkward and alien way. Oh, it doesn't look like this is going anywhere anytime soon. Arkham, Innsmouth, Newport, Newport. I think any of them sound better than her. Oh yeah, of course it's still watching us. It literally did a drive-by on Thomas Wade's girl and then it's back for more. Oh, that doesn't load well. Open. Well, I hope this guy's more... The evening. Wade killed his own daughter, his own flesh and blood. Don't know how much of it was his flesh, his blood either. What do you mean, maybe, Charlie? I seen Elliot dragging him off, caked in blood he was. I, the birch reckon she were ripped open, Joe. I don't reckon Tom oh. had the strength for that sort of kid. I ain't got much time for talking, Charlie. I got instructions from the order to make certain the outsider doesn't oh. leave tonight. That be the Not that many outsiders, I reckon that's us. Hours back. Yeah. <laughs> I'm reckoning on him asking for lodging here this evening. Yeah, I think I might take my business elsewhere, thanks a lot. Ah, oh, hey guys, what are you talking about? Anything I should know about? Joe? Joe? What a nice guy. Evening. Hi. My name's Jack Walters. I'm just visiting. You don't say, sir. Gilman. Charlie Gilman. I don't reckon they've got I much of a uh, peripheral Gilman vision if they couldn't see me from over there. For the night? We've plenty on the top floor of the house. Nice views over the town, I'm told. Yeah, there's a lot to see. Great. What? The, that sounds just swell. What are we seeing? It's almost like we're seeing the future. But uh, you all right there, sir? You're starting to look kind of funny there for a you're while. You're starting to look kind of funny yourself, Faces white Gilman. As bone and eyes as black as coal, like you'd seen a ghost or something. Okay, there's a key behind reception. I'm fine, thanks. It's just the sea air around these parts it makes me queasy. Yeah, the something familiar. This is not for your outsiders. Charlie, can you come with me? I need to be telling you something. Perfectly. Excuse me, sir. The Innsmouth Law doesn't like to be kept hanging about. <laughs> I'll be right back with you shortly. Okay, that's ironic. They spent quite a lot of their time hanging about. You go tell Quasimodo what's what, and mm -hmm. I think I'm going to help myself to a key. I think I saw a shotgun as well, just on the wall. I think we better get to it sharpish. Although, wait, no, no, this guy's across the street. He's not even. Here we go. It's the key to the back office. Did did he go to the back office or did he go to the? That's not a shotgun. That is. <laughs> that is the furthest thing from a shotgun. It's unlocked. Okay, right. Let's. Oh, well, we might as well root Nothing through that stuff interest. when we're here. Really? God, where's your adventurous spirit? Ooh, shotgun shells. What happened in- There are severed body parts strewn all over the office. Okay, did they not pay this voice actor enough to emote? Yeah, severed body parts, dude. Oh, that's that the- that's- oh, that's the meat cleaver we just saw. What's this? Post-mortem records. <clears throat> she were a lively one and no mistake. I kept her going as long as I could for the music she were making. Such a pair of lungs, and after she were done, I found those lungs on her look as good as they sounded. Maybe I'll keep them. Her liver was particular sweet as well. 
and I've much wanted to go to New York, but if they all talk as much as this one, I reckon I ain't missing much. As soon as he woke and saw the knives, he was away talking and pleading and bargaining for his life. All them words made me dizzy and I had to take his tongue first to stop him. In future, I better wait a while after they eat dinner, for his innards stank awful. I think they'd stink regardless. The bones were neatly all out before he died. I was real careful around the artery, so as he didn't lose any more blood, then he could be helped, and he lasted a lot longer for it. The flesh moved on its own as he tried to work his arm, but with the bones gone, there just weren't nothing it could do, just twitch. I took it out of the strap so it could move free, and I watched. The new gang worked much better, and he was more quiet than the last. The new gag. Okay. I wonder what unsavory character. This book holds. You don't have to wonder much more. Yeah, so our sanity is going part, everywhere. There are body parts strewn all over the office. So I wonder if this is actually the hotel receptionist who's doing all this messed up stuff. Oh, there's another head. They must be related. They look pretty similar. Okay, I think we gotta go. Are we gonna... We got caught. If you just follow me, sir... I'll show you to your lodgings. Yeah, sure. I heard there was a killing over the old Waits house tonight. They reckon the old fool killed his own daughter. And what do you Kate reckon? had to toe in her blood, they says. And had to be dragged away, screaming and crying. I think I'd prefer I small talk. be a lynching for what he done. Also, what's wrong with his suspenders? <laughs> right? Are they supposed to work like that? I don't know. It's all just to keep his dad bod in. What do we got here? Is this the top floor? Awful dark. Oh, that's a sight to wake up to. Pallid, sir. You're needing to have yourself some rest. Sleep well. And keep down the racket. Us Innsmouth are... Quiet fall. I haven't said a word since we started walking, sir. Oh. Oh my god. Yeah, it was him. He's quiet. But while he said he tells me to keep quiet, he sounds like he's a big fan of interest uh, here. Do we not need these? Is that a 2D? I can't tell. No no, it's 3D. But he did say he liked the sounds of screaming. Right, well, I'm not too keen to go to bed right away. 401. I feel like 401 is a number I recognize. Oh, the two bedroom? Anything out here? Maybe across the, the way? It's cold enough without opening the window. It's late. I don't think it'd be wise to wake the other guests. How aggressively were you planning on opening that? Okay, well, let's have a quick look. Oh, no. So they have. Yeah. Two points of ingress, two points of egress. Can't see anything of use. Yeah, neither can I, Jack. You're useless. Oh. Nope. Nothing important here. No, I want to see what's behind him. Nope. Nothing of interest. Swear to God, this guy. He deserves to be unemployed. Let's have a look at maybe these drawers. Ah, I reckon we should just get get some Better. sleep. Not exactly safe, but the best I'm gonna get in this infernal town. I really don't think that's true. I think you could go to sleep anywhere else rather than, like, the butcher's very own lodgings. Early evening. Innsmouth turned out to be more dilapidated, depressed, and unwelcoming than initially expected. The stench of rotten fish fills the air, while poverty and disease lie festering in every cobbled back street. Only a few of the inhabitants have been at all cooperative. The others are evasive and sometimes downright hostile. My detective's instinct tells me they're trying to hide something. Of course, I could simply be prejudiced by their look and manners. They're almost ugly enough to get me believing these local tales of the Innsmouth Tame. Of the Innsmouth Tame. Even so, I've been able to make some progress. Finding Ruth Billingham was a lucky break. She's convinced Loverboy is still in one piece and being held in the town jailhouse. I think we found his pieces. Rebecca Lawrence is clearly afraid of something. She doesn't come across as the type that scares easily, but then I guess she's not afraid enough to leave. She seems more worried about me. Then there's Zadok Allen, the old mummy, rummy. He was willing to talk all right. I wish I knew whether he turned to drink because of what he saw, whether he saw these things because he was drinking. The Order of Dagon, some heathen religion brought back from the South Seas by Obed Marsh. Rituals on Devil's Reef. 
Those who wouldn't join massacred by some kind of monsters in 1846, it's all so far-fetched, but what else could explain that thing that charged from Thomas Waite's attic? If I hadn't spoken with Thomas himself, I'd be sure I was seeing things. Just like you saw things six years ago in the Yith house? Whatever's really going on, this place gives me the creeps. The dreams are becoming stronger. I seem to spend each night in weird, fantastic landscapes with immense buildings like no architecture I've ever seen. And my body in the dreams, it's so strange I can't begin to describe it, maybe it's some buried memory of all the occult stuff I studied when I wasn't myself. And this spooky vision thing is acting up worse than ever. Used to be, I could kind of see what people were thinking sometimes and now it's gone crazy, it's like someone's watching me all the time, tracking me from the rooftops in the shadows. I'm so edgy, I can hardly think straight. Shoutouts to Hot Topic. If only I could get some decent bourbon in this miserable town. I need to track down Brian Burnham, and fast. The sooner I get out of here, the better, and I'll make an early start in the morning. We should have made an early start so much earlier. It's ridiculous that this guy can literally see visions of the man massacring people, and still decides to sleep here. Like, it's, it's insane. Those are the camels. The city of Narcotus. Oh, that's how you pronounce it. Rest now, Jack. You are safe. I don't feel safe. What was in the light, Jack? Where do you want to go? I don't know. History, Jack, Anywhere but here. The future. I don't understand. Well, in time. I can't act. Human, where have you put the outsider? Oh, they're coming for us Dark now. The house. Room 401. When did we put the keys back? Come on, let's have them. Also, wasn't that the back office key? Jack, this is not the time to be dreaming. We need to leave. This is interesting though. I ask us where we wanted to go and I wonder. I wonder what we said. Attack of the Fishmen. That's a bit rude, they're just ugly. I can't believe how willfully ignorant Jack is. He's practically in denial. I'm really lucky that I actually no, deadbolted the doors. Just keep the noise down. It's like I have a shotgun. Take the keys. Must have a hell of a silence for if you're gonna keep the noise down. It's locked. Probably bolted on the other side. He's away to go. There. I can hear him moving about. Break the door down, you damn fool. We gotta go. Not time to worry about the cold. <gasps> Wait, what? Hurry up. I suppose this is still a Bethesda game. We jumped out the window so hard that we fell out of the map. You can't escape! I have entirely escaped. Oh, look at this. There must be a stealth section where you have to get past all the fishmen. Have you got me now? I don't know. Wherever I am. Oh, look at that. A propeller. Hurry up! I'm spending far more time down here than I should, but it's just kind of interesting. We've entered a third dimension architecture I've never seen. Anyway. Okay. Let's try be more sensible this time. That apparently was not the sensible option. I should have known better. Okay, so quick! I see them ahead. I don't have to. The window's locked. I won't be able to open it. Okay, well, what do I actually? Shut. Oh, I see. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, thank God we bolted it. We bolted it. We bolted it. The lock on the door is broken. I'll have to block the door with something. Okay. Yep. Quickly. Yeah, yeah, I can think of it. Okay, for some reason the music keeps cutting out, but again, Bethesda games. Shout out to my favorite Skyrim boys. Oh no no no, okay come on, this is perfect, this is perfect. 
Go on, Jack. Tell me you can fit through here with your massive broad shoulders. Jack, there we go. Stop. It won't budge. Where am I going? Shoot him. Please don't shoot me. Oh my god. Jack, why don't, why don't you have a run button? Take him down. Okay, I think we're gonna make it. I think we're gonna make it. Oh, amazing. I hate that. I hate that so much. No way. Oh, I thought there would be dead bolts on the door, so it would be worth there. closing. After him. Okay. No way. Okay, I think they can just open that, though. Oh, we're definitely making progress. No! Fishman? It won't budge. What? What? Okay, guys, I've honestly been trying this a while, and it's an incredibly frustrating sequence. Because it's all just trial and error. They don't give you enough margins to actually figure out what to do. So if you don't know, you don't know. Break the door down, you down. Why is my game going in slow motion? Oh, finally. Oh, that took so much longer than it should have taken. Okay, up, 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 Stranger, stop! Okay. Wait, where even is there to go? Around this way? Is there another lap? Oh, here we go, here we go. Ah, oh, save point. Oh, thank God. Let's grab this first. Because that was a whole ass journey. Honestly, you won't believe the amount of footage I had to cut out at the end. I was basically speedrunning the chase. Um, because for some reason, I think it's because I kept taking a little bit of damage that my jump wouldn't... Sneak mode. So my jump actually wouldn't take me to the platform, right? Like, I was jumping at a decent time... And I hope he doesn't turn around, dude. Wait, this timing might be perfect. What the hell? Ah, look at that. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, timing wasn't perfect. Timing wasn't perfect. We gotta go. It won't open. It won't open? Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is perfect. Okay, that's where we just came out of. Uh... Okay, all of this bullet time is, like, patently unhelpful. Ah, uh, oh, vent, 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 vent. Here we go. Looks like progress, boys. <laughs> so, yeah, this is a hell of an extended chase sequence. I think, like, there are so many small little things they could have done to make it better and make it less possible. Also, really weird they'd have two save points so close. But... Oh, we're seeing it from the butcher's That's perspective the again. He's hiding somewhere. We definitely have a deeper connection to the fish being. Same reason they chose us to come for the cult of Yith. Like, we were... Oh, okay, that's the hole we want to go into. Yeah, we were the cause, right? God, I could do with some health stuff. I'm not entirely sure, like... Oh, yeah, we're doing badly everywhere. Okay, so let's... Let's, uh... Yeah? Okay. Yeah, I think that's good. So how do we actually use them? Okay, is that fine? Oh yeah, there we go. Perfect. It does a little bit of the Far Cry thing where you just slap it on and it and it's all good to go. Right, so we should definitely pay a little bit of attention to the patrol route. So we wanted to get to the hole in the floor. Right. Honestly, I wish we could just knock out this guy and take his gun. 
because that would be perfect. But not today, I guess. Oh, look at this. Ah, oh, if only I were a little bit thinner. Didn't have that Christmas weight. Okay. Um, where was that hole now? I feel like it was right here. Oh, I can hear him, I can hear him. Let's go around the other way. This section is going... Here we go, dude. Here we go. Perfect. Is that a rat? Oh, there's two rats. Hello, my friends. You are my only kin now. No humans, only fishmen and rats. And I think of... I don't know if they'll bite me if I get too close. Or if they're like friendly rats. Well, they're a lot more friendly than the other locals. So we'll take it. I gotta get my... Oh yeah, look at this. This is perfect. Nice. Perfect. Look at this. It's really hard to go up ladders. Like, you can't look around at all. Uh... Oh. How do you know you lost me? Get the front door open. Search the alleys and streets. In the name of the Order of Dagon, find the outsider and kill Oh shit, this Order really wants me dead. I'd better watch my step. Yeah, I don't think any of that is a surprise. They have All been the shooting at you for locked. a while. These shelves look light enough to push. Okay. Light enough to push for a save point. Yeah, so it's really weird how frequently they're having set points now. I feel like this was like, there was some player testing and people started getting real frustrated. So we crashed again. Um, and it was just when we were pushing this as well. Okay, I had to look it up and apparently, if you crouch whilst pushing the box, it might not crash. The other solutions included only using one of your CPU cores. Um, I think I'm starting to see, like, I'm starting to see why, despite all of the potential this game had, it didn't have, like, a huge following, is because there are so many bugs which, um, literally just terminate the game, which make it, without workarounds, nigh on unplayable. And bear in mind, this is also after I've included a fan patch of the game. He's still there. Oh my god. I thought they'd all left to look for me on the streets. This is after using a fan patch of the game, which is supposed to fix a lot of the fatal blo fatal bugs. Okay. Oh. oh, dude, no way. We were going entirely the wrong way. Okay, that's nice. Luckily, I am harder to see, but I don't know if it affects like how they hear me. I don't think it does. So I think when we're behind them, it's best for us to move like this. Right, well, we're making progress. That's the thing, it's like... Wanted for theft. Would I steal your heart? Yeah, it's like... Really fun game to play. When it lets you play. Oh no, there's one person who's still on our tail. But do they see us? I don't reckon... I don't recognise these streets well enough. I don't think I'm meant to get up there. I should give that a break. But this... Dude, you never saw me. Don't pretend you saw me. Oh, what did I just pick up? Sorry, scratching my nose. Uh, no general evidence. No diary. Okay, what did I pick up? Was it just a bandage? Let's, uh, we might as well heal that while we're here. Perfect. Sorry, I've been watching It's Hollow, so like... Who's there? <laughs> oh, okay, let's be quiet. Wait for him to patrol the other way. Yeah, I've been watching a lot of Hollow, and like, everything he does, he's like, perfect, perfect. So it really starts to rub off on you. Yeah, there he is, look. So if we let him patrol all the way back, we should be good. There we go. A little bit further. Looks oh, like an dude. old coal shed. It was 50-50 and we went the wrong way. <laughs> it worked out though. It's good to know. 
So I'm wondering when the FPS elements come in, because we have... Oh, I guess we ought to follow him. Oh, this is dicey, huh? But yeah, we have pistol rounds, we have shotgun Christ, rounds. Christ, they're everywhere. I need to keep my head down. Yeah. We have rifle rounds, um, shotgun rounds, pistol rounds. But we don't have any of those guns. It won't budge. Dude, how long are we going to have to follow this guy? Please don't stop patrolling the other way, dude. Keep going. Is he going to come back? If he's going to come back, I need somewhere to hide. Like here? This looks like a reasonable hiding place. Jack, you read my mind. Alright. Nothing to see here. Are fish good at seeing in the dark? I always assumed they would be kind of good at seeing in the dark, because, you know, the sea gets very little light. But, maybe they got like the worst of fish and the worst of humans. It certainly feels that way. Oh, great. William! Yeah? William! For God's sake! Oh Your my god. Friend is dead. Jesus Jack, Christ! Jack, stop being no. such an asshole. You're a fool, Willie. Told you it wasn't safe in there. Look, fella, I know you're upset, but I really need some help. Give me a gun, give me uh, anything. You're the outsider they're hunting tonight. You don't have a hope, stranger. <laughs> the Order's mob will be everywhere you turn. Down the sewers is the only place that them folks balk at venturing. And for good cause at that, mind you. Yeah, you probably get more of the fish, air. fish. It'll be a change from the stink of dead fish. You're not getting my meaning, stranger. There's rumor of real horrors in the black dankness beneath these streets. Oh, please Maybe show me. Maybe the folk with the are devils. But at least they're devils of this earth. You ever hear tell of a shaggoth, stranger? Just tell me where I can get into the sores. All right. You've been warned. Just the other side of this here building is a road leading down to the filtration plant. There's an open sewer pit down there. Perfect. Good luck, stranger. I love how they- how quickly everyone recovers from death. Like, first of all, he was crying for William, but it's also like, oh, look at that broken bone. Gnarly, dude. So, filtration plant, sewers, and maybe we're gonna meet ourselves some real monsters. Oh, no, this will help us. Look, if we remove this wedge, we'll create just enough chaos. I think. Can we get in the back? No? The door's locked. I can't get in the cabin. Oh, it's already starting to roll. Okay, let's let's give it a Oh! I'm getting shot. Oh, this is what they meant by keep their head down, I guess. Hopefully that takes care of business. Okay, I think we were supposed to be in the truck, which is why they're, um, chasing us right now. Hey, boys. Did you miss me? Okay. There were definitely better, better ways of getting in there. Okay, we need to deal with a lot of things stat. Hopefully they haven't got an angle on us down here. No, no, don't shoot him. Don't, don't shoot him. <laughs> Alright. I hope that's, um... Not as hard as it looks. Heard that. <gasps> Crowbar! Yeah, yeah, can I equip it? No. Okay, those are wheels. Oh, there must be like a... A main entrance. Can I use any of these things to jam it? Wait, okay, let's... Oh my god. That is more than a stu- Oh. Okay, we need more than that. Anything in here? Now oh, there's gotta be- mess of twisted metal. There's gotta be something I can use. Oh, it slows down and speeds up. That's unintuitive. Um, okay, let's take care of that. 
Are we going to be good to go? Ready to deal with any Shagoths? I thought they were Shoggoths, but I guess they might be um, different creatures as well. Oh. I don't feel a great deal more comforted in here. I think William's friend had a point. So I reckon we'll keep going. It doesn't make much sense to end the episode just on a chase, so I think we'll do this uh, next section. Why are you crying, child? Oh, that sounds so close. It's really like an anglerfish, you know? They bait you with light. Are we gonna see him through here? Hello? Hey kid, you forget your doll. No, wait! Oh, I didn't quite catch a glimpse of it. Let's should we can we take it? Oh. I don't know if the doll or looking at a thing is messing with our sanity, but either way. I'm feeling some very bad energy what in the, the studio hell? right now. Ah shit, it's oh. corrosive. Ah. Let's not stand on it. Or maybe the thing we saw is what killed the child who was crying. I don't, I don't know why I'm here. Yeah, I don't know why you're here either, Jack. Oh, look at his, look how his fingers have been stretched out. Maybe this is what they mean when they're like removing all of, oh. When they're like down here. removing all of his bones. You know how his fingers look sort of wobbly? That's crazy. There is something down here. There's at least one thing, Jack. You smart bean, you. Is this a puzzle? I don't, I don't know what that did. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait. He's scared he didn't want to die. I'm guessing he did something drastic. Maybe that guy was trying to kill him. Ah, uh, is there anything we can do about this? It won't budge. Won't budge, huh? Okay, let's see if any of these... Maybe that's going to be an off switch? It sounds like it's got potential, right? I'm not entirely sure... What's that sound? Um, did, did we just see it through there? It's coated in slime. I'm not touching it. Stop being such a baby. Okay, um, okay, so my guess is one of these is cleaner than the other. So we'll try turning the left one on first. That sounds cleaner. Let's have a look. Yeah, look at that. Okay, so after we've washed it out with water, we'll turn that off. We'll go clear it out again, and hopefully, this will be the way forward. Yeah, perfect. Look at that. Again, not a hugely intuitive puzzle, but I kind of appreciate that they don't hold your hand through the whole thing. That's what it was looking through. Oh, and these all must be cockroaches, or like... Small ground koi. Yeah, I realise I've not commented on what I've just seen. Yeah, this might be a better place for us to be. Ah, oh, it's interesting, because we saw all these cockroaches in the opening scene. But that was, um... That was prior to these events, so maybe it's something we're experiencing again, or... It was like a premonition. Looks Got like it. the main sewer pipe. The grating has been heavily damaged. Jack, is that the Is that the only thing you want to comment on? The sewer pipe? Okay, that's fine. As As long as it only hurts for you. This is so dark. Oh, I love this. This is so good. Look at that. We are going mad. I'm definitely closing that door. I don't know, Jack, what have you done? My father had the answer. They're calling to me. 
tell you one thing you haven't done. Swallowed for a while, I can hear all of the water in your voice. Okay. Let's head down. I'm being followed. Are you being followed or are you following? Oh, hey. Are you okay? Wait, it's Tom Waits' kid. Is it because, maybe it's it's because it was our fault she died, or maybe she really didn't die? Maybe I she'd already transitioned. Straight with me, I can feel her. Yeah, she is following us. So I, I kind of wonder if if I was less insane right now, whether we'd be seeing her the same way we are. Oh, that was a bit of a fool. We should be careful. Oh yeah, look at that. That was a hell of a fool. What the hell? We got a whole leg bone showing. This is not your day, Jack. This is not your day. It's so cool though, we're seeing some really messed up stuff, which is... I mean, if you're playing horror, it is a little bit what you're here for. Okay, I think we'll, yeah, avoid getting too close to these crabs. Ow! Kind of what I expected to happen, to be honest. Hopefully, yeah, they're not going through the spiderweb looking thing. Oh, I'm so pleased though. This is really cool. It's kind of been worth getting through all the jank of the game to really... Yep, I'll be going right back down, thank you very much. To see all of the cooler elements. Because obviously there's so much to appreciate here. And, um... And it's just rarely done justice, really. Oh, wait, we can't go up any of these. Maybe there was something, um, alternative I could have done. Yeah, yeah, let's try that again. China, stop. Really? Really, game? Is this how we're gonna play it? Okay, we're just gonna have to side strafe. Side strafe and think of England. Ooh, medkit. Might be needing that in a second. I'm in no hurry to get back into the sewers. I prefer to take my chances in the streets. Okay. Uh, where would you like to face those chances exactly? Kill him. Okay. The nice thing is they won't actually Kill shoot you. I mean, these Kill posters him. are everywhere. Die outside. Oh, here we go. Nice. Ah, uh, I don't know what this thing is clouding my vision. Oh. Well, we are not doing well. Maybe it's- maybe it's our head injury. Okay, let's figure out a head injury first. And then... Hopefully that will clear up the fogginess. The injury system is really cool. It does remind me a little bit of Fallout. Yeah, look at that. It's um... We had like a really bad concussion or something. Spread out! Search the area! That could have been really bad. That could have been really bad. Okay, so they're definitely looking for me. Yeah, I feel like... I heard that. I heard that too. There. What was that? Everything keeps breaking. It's here! Oh my god, come on. Give a guy a break. Oh, there's a winch. But what does the winch do? Maybe it's unblocking a path? Where is he? Could be anywhere, geniuses. Oh, and it'll lower it back down too. So can I get an oil lantern or something so I can see better? Oh, that was close. It won't open. Look at us. Innsmouth's most wanted. Oh, it keeps giving me ammo, but I've definitely just missed the opportunity for guns. I mean, do BIs usually carry guns? I guess not. Look, it's our lady. Jack, you're alive. Thank God. Barely. Just barely. The order is <laughs> yeah. gonna have this blasted town on my heels. 
I warned you, Jack. Yeah, half this blasted I town is blasted. Order wouldn't stand Save it, sweetheart. You found anything more on Brian? Wow, why is he? He never made it out of town. <laughs> I guess you know. The order has him he should holed be frustrated. up in the old jailhouse until he's needed. Needed? Needed for what? Sacrifice, Jack. To Dagon, they'll take him out to Devil's Reef, and he'll never be seen again. Dagon? Sacrifice? This is crazy talk. Innsmouth's old <laughs> fishing tales have muddled your mind. Jack believes but in facts and logic. I don't want another death on my conscience. Where's this jailhouse? It's out the back of the Merchant's Bank, just past the old water tower. We better keep off the streets. The tainted are roaming everywhere. There's a secret crypt under the church that leads out to someplace safe. We can use that. My father built it when he was minister. Okay, get your father and let's go. I can't. I mean, he wouldn't pledge himself to Dagon. He called it blasphemy. The Order found him and... and... Jeez. I'm sorry, <laughs> Rebecca. Did your father ever show you how to get into this crypt? Oh, I'm sorry for your loss. No. By the way, but though, what about this. that crypt? I think it'll help. Oh, did she get hit? Did you really have to take a peek? I think it's pretty clear what that was. Oh, thank God! This is this is going to give us actual direction. I can stop thinking. Uh oh, Rebecca, we've got to go. We'll have to make a run for it. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Run then. Go on. We'll Think like a fish. Inside. If I was a fish, where would I aim? Yeah, no! Jack! I'll be joining her if I don't get moving. Jack! Oh my god. Have a little bit more thought about your friends. Rebecca, no! I better get going. Could be bad for me too. What an asshole! Night. There's no going back now. The locals want me dead. That's clear enough. They can't afford to let me get away now. Even in the sanctuary of the church, I don't feel safe. Though it looks like Rebecca was right. They're not making any effort to break in like they did at the hotel. I'm gonna miss her. Still, at last I have a lead on Brian Burnham. Rebecca was convinced he's alive and being held at the town's jailhouse, but where is the jailhouse? According to Rebecca's directions, I need to find the merchant's banks and then the wardchant tower. I'm a mess, sorry. <laughs> and then the water tower in order to reach it. That's easier said than done though, these things have been pretty much trapped in here. Eventually one of them may think of burning the place down or they may overcome their fear of the place and come bursting in. I need to find that secret way out, Rebecca said her old man's postcard would help, but I don't know how. I just hope I don't have to go back through those sewers. There's something down there for sure. I thought it was just another tall tale at first, but I could feel it. And that slime. It's like a trail from something. Something not natural. What did that hick call it? A uh, shogoth? The Order's grip on the folk of this town is strong, and they'll stop at nothing. Rebecca's murder proves that, and old Zadok. Looks like they beat him to death for talking to me. I should have left the poor old Rami alone. Give yourself up out. Yeah, I mean, we are leaving a trail of death and destruction behind us, and we have very little to show I for it. There's no way out of there. Uh, I think I beg to differ. I think we'll find a way. Let's have a peek up, peek up in the rafters. Wait, they're about to break in. I thought they Just didn't want to. Give yourself up, outsider. The order will have mercy on your rotten soul. There's probably a sequence in which you can grab these. I should let the bell finish ringing first. I should let the bell finish ringing first. Okay. So let's look around for clues on what order we'd like to ring these bells. You can't get oh, away! look at that. They actually crucified him up there. That's insane. Oh, this game has so many cool moments. But it is incredibly frustrating. Look at that. Gnarly. And this looks There's like... There's a raised section of tiling in the yeah, baptismal that's, pool. That's no definitely how we get out. You need a it's clue. It's the minister of the church. The pulpit is stained with blood. Hung up and disemboweled. Up so it's weird. They, no they'd come in to hang and disembowel him, but he won't... 
they won't break in this time. Okay, so I think we will actually call the episode here, because it has been a long time recording. Because I took so long with that chase sequence, and then the entire time trying to navigate my way through the streets has been nigh on impossible. Um, I think it's really starting to get going. I am excited to see what happens next time, but uh, it might be a little while before I play again. There are definitely a few other games I want to play. I don't know, actually, maybe I'll record tomorrow. We'll see. But anyway, you know, if you got this far, like, subscribe, do whatever you like. Uh, peace.